hello and welcome back to the channel everybody so in this week's video we're going to be looking at security devices uh, externally of the van just to give you an idea of what we have and how they're installed uh, so if you're in the market of looking to get some of these kind of devices hopefully this video will be beneficial for you so what we're going to do is I'll take you outside and uh, yeah we'll just work our way around the caravan installing each one and having a quick talk about uh, the devices that we use and we'll go from there so the first device we're going to look at is the 25 elco secure wheel lock um, quite standard on a lot of vans again purpose here is obviously to lock the wheel and stop this being towed away so um, yeah since you've had this no issues in terms of installing this what you need to remember though is when you're on site um, the way this attaches is with a, a locking wheel nut um, and you need to make sure that when you're centering the caravan you keep this in mind because there, there is only one way that this can go on and if it's lined up wrong this won't actually fit so what you could end up doing is actually getting the caravan all set up and then when you go to attach this it's in the wrong alignment and you can't install this so I'll, I'll show you now how the correct way to install it so when you're looking at the alignment this is the the actual nut where it goes into um, and what you want to be doing is when you're levering the caravan and going backwards and forwards and obviously getting the side to side angle correct it's it's looking at this once you're finished so the nut what you got to think is going to go through here and with that, you just want to make sure it's centered on this part. Um, otherwise, when you go to attach this, it won't line up. Um, and then, yeah, you might get flustered and go, oh, I'll just forget about it. But then that's your security for device gone. So yeah, just again, like a checklist, um, just make sure it's all aligned, centered up when you finish. So that should be one of your last things that you're looking at is, getting it all leveled up and then is this in the right place so when you come to attaching the device you'll get the the bolt it's got a special um, locking wheel nut um, cap at the end so it is unique to your caravan then it's a case of just lining it up spinning it around till it goes in this is the, the the nut that comes with the actual kit and it'll, like I say, it'll be unique to your caravan. You can use this to get it started, start locking it into place. Then you can move on to screwing it on like a, a car wheel. Uh, and then tweaking it up, like I say, you don't want to go too mad. Um, do you want to be able to get it off again? Then it's just a case of releasing uh, the locking wheel nut bolt, and then this is just to lock it into place. You just put it in, turn the key, and then you're good to go. That's in place. So the second device that we have is the Alco hitch lock and to install this it got, it's got a couple of parts so you lift it up lock it in place first bit is, is for the nose of the hitch again that comes with the kit just watch your fingers put it underneath put it on the palm of your hand and lift it into place and then with the other hand just push down have you heard see it locks into place that's secured and then it's just about attaching the actual lock itself these can be a little tricky but it should just slot slot into place like that and it's just a case of locking it into place and then that's it So the third device that we have is another wheel lock. Um, I'm not sure what actual brand this is. Uh, this is what we got with the caravan itself. 
um, but seems to do the job. And, and this is just a case of it goes through the back of the wheel and then is locked back up from the front. And it should just go around like that, go through and just lock into place. Um, again, it's just another a deterrent to stop somebody trying to steal the caravan. Um, and then on, with this one, obviously you've got one device on each wheel, um, but it should only take a few seconds to install. Um, and, and again, these are quite a, a, a universal type of lock. Um, so you should be able to get these up from most sort of um, Amazon, eBay, a caravan store, that kind of place. But um, yeah, try and get a, a good quality lock. So the fourth device we have is for the steadies. Um, you would add an, an adapter where you would normally wind the caravan up, um, and it comes the kit comes with a, another attachment um, that you would use to wind the caravan up going forwards. Go in, use your screwdriver along those lines of just winding it through to make it go up and down, and then once it's in place in all level, you have this device, and it's just a case of putting that on and again it just locks it in and you have that on both sides um, and again quite straightforward to fit it only takes a few minutes and it's just another deterrent um, for, the, for the thieves trying to steal your caravan So there you have it, that's our four external devices that we have uh, in terms of security. Um, each one takes a few minutes to install and uh, I'll just say it's the first one, the Alco wheel lock is the one that you need to be mindful of, that's the one that will cause you the most problems if you forgot to get it centred when you're, you're first placing the caravan. Um, so yeah, that's probably the only one you need to be mindful of, um, other than that, like you say, a few minutes per device, if that, and then job done. what i would say is these only are a deterrent and um, to stop the thieves taking the caravan i wouldn't say that this would slow them down in terms of indefinitely um as always if, if they're looking to steal a caravan they'll have ways of removing these devices the idea here is just to slow them down hopefully if you're on a site um, well hopefully a this doesn't happen but if you are again there's people around that i will hopefully hear something uh, and we'll uh, raise the alarm of, of what's going on but um, yeah the more devices that you have the slower it's going to be for them to remove the caravan so just something one last thing to bring up is uh, obviously when you're looking at insurance policies for your caravan um, by having these devices this will reduce the premium um, certainly when we did ours the Elco uh, devices the hitch and the wheel lock were certainly items that were um, an optional where we could actually select and reduce that premium. Um, I don't remember seeing actually the, the other two in terms of wheel lock um, on the other side and the, the devices that we have on the rear. Um, I don't recall those but certainly the Alco devices at the front were and it did reduce our premium but um, like I say it's going to be a case of, a case of going on a, a number of websites um, talking to people on forums to see who they've insured their caravans with to get sort of an idea of what a reasonable price is and a good insurance provider um, and then yeah just just seeing what comes back but certainly worth ticking these through and just making sure that yeah you do get a reduction but that certainly was the case for us so hopefully this week's video has been useful to some of you um, like I say it, it's normally aimed at um, sort of people getting into caravan where they're looking to get insurance they're looking to get security devices and um, they like say there's many different brands out there uh, and different types of hitch locks um, wheel locks as I like say we've got two different types on ours so there's yeah, a, a number of products out there it's just a case of finding uh, which ones work for you do a bit of research like I say I'll do some questioning on forums um, and again there's always lots of information on there but certainly worthwhile 
um, having a look at these devices. But um, yeah, like I said, hope like you, you enjoyed the, the, the video. Please subscribe to the channel if you're liking the content and I will see you on the next one.